hey yeah I've got a dial combination lock here and this time it's a word lock okay it's very similar to those cheap combination locks where it's got both they've both got a keystone and a white circle in the middle this dial's wider this keystone maybe is a little bit more pronounced with the cheap ones the shackle is about seven and a half mils whereas this one it's about it's a, it's a little bit more maybe very similar and can it be shimmed if I put a shim down here try and force it down there it's gone down now and yep it opens so it can be successfully shimmed and when I turn it several times pull up on the shackle and it doesn't click into every two or three numbers or letters in this case so I'm going to start at A tension the shackle quite a bit of tension Channeling it around, hmm, it seems to want to stop it at, at V, going to go all the way around the other way. Um, that clicked, but I've got a lot of play here in between two numbers or letters that won't let me out so I think the last number or the last letter is somewhere between N and O it looks as though it's more around O so if that's the last one I'll keep on going please tension turn it tension again and I'm back to um, where I started with um, no other clicks or stoppages so I don't think V's right. If I turn several times and go past V, hang on, let's go past V. It starts to get really tight around about there. Going to release tension, go past T. Uh, what was that a click or was it just I, I don't know let's go and check it out to our last number which was oh, oh and it opens okay so it was what was it T what did I turn it to A or B and then to O and we got an open okay and oh, S C O so I went T B O and that's close enough for the tolerances of this lock. Thanks.